Netanyahu vows his country will strike back at the Islamic militant group Hamas after the kidnapping and killing of three Israeli teenagers. Netanyahu was among thousands of mourners who attended a funeral service for the slain teens today. Their bodies were found yesterday in the West Bank. One of the teens' aunts is in Southern California. News Channel 3's Sharin Rajay has her reaction, plus what the local Jewish Federation is saying this evening. And again, they were just boys, just kids. Lihi Sha'ir, who just moved to Los Angeles, says her nephew, 16-year-old Gilad Sha'ir, was always smiling, loved life, and was taking care of his five sisters. I don't believe that he's not here anymore. I don't believe it. Gilad and his two friends were found dead on Monday, not far from where they disappeared more than two weeks ago in a West Bank village. They were hitchhiking home from school when Israeli leaders say the Palestinian militant group Hamas kidnapped and then murdered them. Oh, I just heard that they found them in the hole, tied, and I guess they shoot them. My brother, Ophir Sedli, at least they didn't suffer much. Could speak directly to in Santa Barbara, the Jewish community is in mourning, outraged by what the head of the Jewish Federation calls an inexcusable loss of life. There's just no justification whatsoever uh, for, for these three young boys uh, to have their lives cut short. Uh, in, in such a, a horrific fashion. Israeli soldiers arrested 400 members of Hamas during the search for the teens. Since the discovery, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu called an emergency meeting to respond. Finding the perpetrators, uh, punishing them appropriately, is absolutely critical. The state of Israel has to do whatever it can to protect its citizens and, and to do so uh, understanding uh, that their actions uh, as well cause harm. Meanwhile, in her grief, Sha'er says she just wants the violence to stop. And we really hope they are the last three victims in this terrorism. In Santa Barbara, I'm Sharon Roger, News Channel 3. The Jewish Federation in Santa Barbara is asking the community to come together in solidarity with the State of Israel. A memorial is being held tonight at 6.30 at the Jewish Federation. It's located at 524 Chapala Street. It is a community event open to everyone. Also tonight, a heartbreaking loss for the...